the lover. The next card in the major arcana is the lover. This card belongs to the zodiac sign of Taurus and its ruling planet Venus. This is a feminine and soft energy. In Greek mythology, Venus is known as Aphrodite, and so she is the goddess of love, and beauty, pleasure, and procreation. Aphrodite was also associated with the planet Venus, which is why in Roman mythology, she is referred to as Venus. Taurus really knows how to enjoy life, how to indulge in the pleasures of life, and Taurus people are usually very practical, very down-to-earth people, very decisive, very, very persistent people. So the card itself shows us a beautiful woman surrounded by symbols of wealth, beauty, and just lush sensuality. She is perhaps Aphrodite herself. She is resting in her abundant garden, surrounded by blooming rose bushes and fruit trees, just ready to harvest. And looking at her foot sticking into the bath and all her precious jewelry, you can already tell that she really likes comfort and beauty. So she is the ultimate Taurus archetype, the ultimate embodiment of Venus and the Venus. The card's message is that it's time for you to do the same. Take care of your body and pamper yourself. Just enjoy yourself. And also try to notice the beauty of life itself. So when you're walking out in nature, just listen to the birds. Uh, stop and smell the roses, smell the flowers. And, you know, just slow down a bit to stop and appreciate life itself and how beautiful this life really is. The person who puts on the most makeup, the one who wears the most jewelry or the most decorated clothes, they are usually the ones who have the least amount of self-worth and they are trying to cover up all that, uh, hide behind all that jewelry, hide behind all that makeup. So these are also definitely themes that are worth looking into, that are worth exploring when this card comes up in a reading and it occupies a more of a negative position. Uh, 